626-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. Alex Jones here with a message to fellow freedom lovers. The prognosis for the entire planetary economic system runs from bad to worse. The globalist model is to shut down societies and starve patriots out until they acquiesce to the global takeover. That's why we've assembled the most vital and important preparedness items at InfoWarsShop.com. These are items that I did research on, that I personally use. You've got the life straw, so you can turn fetid water into safe water anywhere you go. The KTOR hand crank generator to charge up key equipment during power outages or out in the field. Strategic relocation, third edition by Joel Skousen. When disaster strikes by Matthew Stein. Therosafe used by Homeland Security to protect yourself during any radiological event. Hand crank shortwave AM FM radios. Everything that we've researched and found to be the best is available at InfoWarsShop.com and your purchase makes our InfoWar possible. We're getting prepared. Are you? InfoWarsShop.com. My friends, Alex Jones here to tell you about some of the most important information concerning you and your family's health. Radiation levels have more than doubled in the last 60 years in the Northern Hemisphere from all of the nuclear testing and radiological accidents. Radioactive contamination is now in most of the food supply. There's only two ways to avoid this. Move south of the equator or properly protect your thyroid with nascent iodine. Looking to protect my family, I've done deep research. Nascent iodine is the purest, cleanest, absolute best form of iodine to protect yourself and your family. It's made right here in the USA, completely non-GMO. I searched out the best quality and now have developed a double strength form of nascent iodine exclusively available at InfoWarsLife.com. Nascent iodine is on record as one of the only safe ways to detox from fluoride poisoning. Survival Shield Nascent Iodine. Secure your super high quality nascent iodine today at InfoWarsLife.com. That's InfoWarsLife.com. Coast to coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. Crashing through the lies and disinformation, it's Alex Jones on the GCN Radio Network. Myself, I'm following the Drudge Report, DrudgeReport.com. It has the Sea uh, Rats at uh, five to zero. We'll put that back up on screen, actually, uh, for folks. Uh, Denver zero. I had somebody ask me on the street today, Alex, who's going to win? And I said, Well, the media says it's going to be uh, Denver. It must be the Seahawks. It's all rigged, anyways. I know you like a uh, underdog coming from behind. Oh, I know the NSA not spying on us too. And Bill Clinton didn't have sex with that woman. I mean, anything this big is rigged. They might have power outages tonight to keep the game going forever. Jakari Jackson is missing the kickoff. We're 18 minutes into the Holy Game. He's about to go in with Josh, and then he'll do some updates inside as well after the show's over in about 15 minutes uh, at InfoWars.com. And we'll also have game coverage at InfoWars.com and PrisonPlanet.com and Twitter, Real Alex Jones. I'm about to go back to calls, but Jakari, what was it like? You, uh, The heroes protected you. On the subway train to get there, they said that was the big terror threat where Al-Qaeda that our own government gave missiles to was going to attack, but, but you were okay, Jakari? That's exactly right, Alex, and we just posted a video. You can guys go go to the uh, to the YouTube page. If I had our new video, we encountered some police down there holding their rifles. I'm not sure if they were fully automatic, but they are definitely uh, the military style, as Ms. Feinstein likes to call them. Also saw some bomb-sniffing dogs and, of course, TSA checking bags for anybody who had a bag. We're, we're outside the stadium now. The security is pretty tight. They don't want us to stand in any one, two places too long. They keep shuffling us around. And right now, from where I'm standing, I can see at least three helicopters. Oh, good. Might not be able to see them on the Oh, on they're the keeping iPhone. us safe. Oh, good. But, yeah, there's at least three helicopters in my eyesight, and I'm just oh, on one the, side oh, of the, the building. Oh, the threats everywhere. Oh. Yeah, yeah. So uh, it's Police Safe 2014. Uh, Police Safe 2014, a.k.a. Super Bowl 48. All right. Anything else, Shakari? No, we're just going to go in here and see uh, what else happens. Uh, may see some weird stuff at halftime, but regardless of what we do, we'll try to get it up as soon as possible for uh, the InfoWars.com viewers and also PrisonPlanet.tv, Twitter, Real Alex Jones. That's right. Who's on tonight at InfoWars.com? Is it Kurt Nemo? I see him posting a bunch of articles today. We'll just continue to have your videos posted by the writers at InfoWars.com. 
as the night develops. Jakari, get in there. You've already missed 18, 19 minutes of the most wondrous well, thing in the world. I, I mean, I, I'm, I'm missing my life. I want my life back, Alex. I'm on this train, and now I'm missing my life. So, yeah, but I, I'm not too eager to get in here and get felt up by the Well, security. it says Met Life right there. You're about to get your life back. Yeah, yeah, I go get my... Uh, Who are you my, rooting for, the uh, sea rats or the uh, psycho donkeys? I'm rooting that we can have a nice, safe uh, event out here without any a bunch, of, any weird Illuminati ceremony. That's what I'm rooting for. No, I'm, I'm rooting sure for there'll be one of those. All right, Jakari Jackson, thank you very much. Thanks, Alex. He'll be back on tomorrow during the weekday show, 11 a.m. Central, to give us the aftermath with Josh Owens. Uh, let's go ahead and go to John in New Jersey, well, the site of the incredible event. John, do you feel blessed to even be near this event? Well, I don't know. I, me as a kid, I always uh, tried to watch wrestling. My dad told me no. And I remember two. You're not going to tell me wrestling's fake either, are you? Well, I, mean, I just remember seeing them three letters NWO. And in NFL, I do know that the ball players are professionals. And even to watching the like, ticket uh, says it's for entertainment purposes only and completely fake. But yeah, you know, I don't read the ticket. I mean, you know. uh, I mean, even watching Al Bundy, I, I I could be like him and maybe sell shoes, you know, like you know. But it's I already know it's something that they they try to make us get into young like that and seeing him. That's right. The like establishment that wants us to drink fluoride, wants to lower our cues, wants us to watch this, so it must be good. Go ahead. Yeah, he, you know, he said he got married when he was young and had kids. That's why it's the excuse why he couldn't be professional, you know. So it's it, like a, it's one one of the few things, even Pinky in the Brain, the cartoon, how they always said they wanted to take over the world. Um, yeah, but that, nobody yeah. in the elite wants to. They've already taken over. Look at how it's all taxpayer paid for. You have these billionaires with the security, everything paid for by us. And again, they go, well, that's okay. But if an old lady doesn't pay her property taxes, here comes the SWAT team. She doesn't. In a cartoon. Yeah. That was in a cartoon when I was a kid. And I, I you know, I, I kind of made sense of it then, but it just was like, oh, well, you know, it's a cartoon. But even watching Jackass, like, that's another show that people mimic, like wrestling, and people get hurt with, not just like kids with guns, like 2020 wanted to say. You know, and had to show about. They never had to show on, you know, people mimicking jackass or wrestling moves and, you know, stuff like that. That's because they so never criticize anything that's establishment. And I appreciate your call, Scott, or, or John. Good point. Scott's up next in Arizona. Scott, go ahead. Hi. Um, yeah, I just wanted to say no issues in this world are black and white. And that's what you guys are making the team out to be right now. Um, and for all you Christian followers, passing judgment, and all the people that love football and are passionate about it, that's a big judgment. No, I agree with you. I, I think I think you the know. fact that in every third world country, sports is absolutely number one is a good thing. Come on, we're not passing judgment. We're we're pointing out good aspects and bad aspects, like I did earlier. And no one can deny that this has become the new religion. What do you think of the NFL having anti-gun, pro-Obamacare messages? Um, you know, I be honest with you I, I agree with you i know it's been hijacked but at the same time i see the beauty and passion and the artistic movement of the human body in motion and you know i know hi, uh, hollywood's been hijacked but that's the human the body mm -hmm. i i you know just because um hollywood's been hijacked doesn't mean we can't receive great stories and great movies and still find the good in it and i see some human football. body which one of the male players bodies do you like the most um, the beauty of a, a if you see a sideline catch when the toes touch down, for someone to be able to do that and control their body, I think that's art. I, I know, I'm being art, sarcastic. I, 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 I hear you. I think that art is just as beautiful as opera. And no, dance. no, no. And I agree with you. Sports passionate. and athleticism is a great thing. My point is we have to say we're sick of the anti gun Obamacare garbage. And it, it, look, should it be tax exempt so Jerry Jones makes an extra billion? Of course not. I, I completely agree with you. I just wanted to point out that it's not black and white. There is beauty in this game, and it's there's a lot of passion behind it. And just one quick which point quarterback too, is um, more beautiful? Scott. Uh, um, just one quick point too is the Walter Payton Award. I know you know obviously a lot of it's showmanship, but there are a tremendous amount of dudes a great character and humility out there. Russell no, no, Wilson, I hear you, I hear you, Dallas like Hill. Tebow and all that stuff or Ty, but whatever. I appreciate your call. I hear you. The point is, is that no one can talk about anything but sports. And women can only talk about entertainment. And I'm just, you know, there's more than the sports pages and the entertainment pages. That's all I'm saying is it's used to distract people. Jim in Pennsylvania, go ahead, sir. Hello, Alex. Hello, my friend. Yes, uh, one of the call 
talk about the sports thing. Oh. Back, back uh, in the mid-90s around here, I live near Pittsburgh, they tried flo- floating a tax initiative to pay for the new stadium. Well, and I'll pay for it for some billionaire. That's reasonable. They tried doing that, and they... Uh, Got voted down by the local population. That means you must not have electronic voting machines. Yeah, most places it's unpopular in the polls, but still passes. I'm surprised it did, didn't magically pass in your area. There's a lot of people against it. And then later on, probably up around 2000, the city of Pittsburgh got into a budget crisis after they implemented Plan B to get the stadiums built. So they still did it. Well, you got to give the billionaires a free stadium. I mean, most rich people got their money from government contracts. That's why all the rich people promote socialism because they're all exempt from it. Biggest recipient, biggest. I got to, I got to, I got to jump, brother. But the biggest recipient of the banker bailouts in 2008 was Warren the Pig Buffett, who lobbies for higher taxes because he's exempt from them and gets your money. Remember that. We got to go fast. Dan in New Jersey, go ahead. Hey, Just, Alex, how are you? Good, brother. Go ahead. I'm actually about a mile outside of the uh, stadium, which is where I live. In, oh, uh, you're so Denver. lucky. Oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, I'll tell you what, the past two months, there's been helicopters all around. The past two nights, I haven't been able to sleep because they've been right above my building. And this morning when I woke up, I was posting something on Facebook about, you know, the, all this stuff. And uh, the cops knocked on my door. Of course, I didn't answer it, you know, because I'm a, you know, liberty-loving, you know, pro-gun. Oh, if one guy was on the loose like Boston, they just make everybody empty out of their houses. Why not? It's no, freedom. Who knows? But, uh, you know, everything is crazy over here. And, and with the Super Bowl, I mean, a lot of people are, are tricked into thinking that it's about sports, but they get sucked in, and it's really about all the uh, imagery that they use. You know, before I Exactly. The game you, I, is the screen to project the propaganda on. That's all I'm saying. Absolutely. Before I uh, started following you, I, I used to listen to uh, Jordan Maxwell a lot, and he went into a lot of... Uh, you know, different symbology and stuff like that. And the more you, the more you read about, it, the more you know, and you see all these things, these entertainers, all the symbols they use. You know, it's just no. Uh, they're it, programming the subconscious mind. I appreciate your call, Lena, Martin, Laura, Mary, and Jim. I'm out of time, but I'll be back tomorrow, 11 a.m. Central, 12 noon Eastern, with the big official weekday transmission, Infowars.com. We did good taking calls. Great job, crew coming in. We can now all go to the Super Bowl parties and bow down to our God. It's not freedom. No, it's Peyton Manning. So we're all going to go right now. It, it, are they still losing? What's the score? Doesn't matter what our freedom is. What's the score? What's the score? Ah, it's at Infowars.com. It's at DrudgeReport.com. What am I going to do? I'll be on Coast to Coast AM tonight. First two hours nationwide. Talking to tens of millions of people. God bless you all. Introducing Pro One. All of your filtration in one system, portable, on the go. No more do you have two or three filters to just reduce sodium fluoride. You have a system that cuts out the sodium fluoride and up to 95% of hydrofluorosilicic acid. Advanced manufacturing technology uh, combines silver losing. impregnated uh, white uh, ceramic with new uh, aquamedics. I'm on my side, no, uh, uh, I'm not manly, no, my, my archetype leader is losing, I'm failing. We have it discounted at 10% off with promo code WATER. This is the only system that in one unit helps reduce or remove pesticides, herbicides, chloramines, ammonia, and chlorine, hydrofluorosilicic acid, the most common form of fluoride not covered by other fluoride filter brands, and sodium hexafluorosilicate. Get your Pro Pure with a new Pro One filter today at InfoWarsStore.com or by calling 800-222-2222.